Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Grimwit. This is Mia Smada. We're getting close to the end of our journey. Well, the end of a journey. There's other things to be discovered. Now. We discovered a map last episode that showed us another trail that leads down to Outpost Rigel. Along the way, looks like around here, we should be able to find a really tall plant that's not like any others. But if we notice over here, there's another camp, and I am kind of all about getting the camps. It's still early in the morning, just before 10, and I believe this is the correct way. Um, I must save, save, save. Is there a way to save in here? Bunsen burner, maybe? Yes. I think I saved here last time anyway. Alright. No sign of our friend, so let's continue on. So very useful having the... Um, I'm not sure what the word amenity means, but I, it feels right to say the amenities of life. Amenity, a desirable or useful feature of a facility, of a building, or place. A pleasantness of a place or person. Grab some of those bare necessities, those simple bare necessities. Hmm. Oh, I want to go that way. But that is not the way to go. What we're actually looking for is a fork in the road that's next to a pillar. Column. Column pillar. Uh, I'm gonna guess this goes this way. At least this trail is easy to find. Again, the trail splits. Let's try this way. Boing, boing. When Robert Hughes does those little bunny hops while he's running, it just tickles me a little bit. He's doing them because, as I've said many times before, Robert Hughes is a marble. And as he's rolling downhill, he'll make these little jumps like a marble would. Thought that rock was a squirrel. Sorry everyone, it was a rock. It wasn't a squirrel after all. Just a rock. Ooh. Oh, I can't grab the cattails. You'd think there'd be some use for a cattail. And all of the plants on this island are so bizarre. I think the term used was, the foliage on this island is bananas. That's about right. Why did I go off the path? Why didn't I stay on the path? Hello? Not one, but two. And an owl statue. Well, let's see what we have here. Little syringe coffin and this. Much research has been done without us. We'll follow that owl in a second. See what it sees. It is supposedly the sixth owl, but unfortunately, we missed the fifth owl. Gandalf, what happened? 
Oh my goodness. This would be Isabel. She has something in her hand. For some reason, that's sadder than the other corpses we found. I'm not sure why. This might have been Isabella's place. And she just leaves a poem. What a way to die. A map to Outpost Rigel. And what did Isabella have on her desk? Photos of patients. Why wouldn't they be? The photo on the right was supposed to be a woman, which should tell you how badly the plague affected people in Telerik. Also, the description mentions the abbey in East Telerik, which I believe was the abbey that Sanchez mentioned seeing a nurse in. Well... As they say, you can't make an omelet without killing a few people, so let's try to continue on. This was Outpost Rigel. I missed whatever camp this is. And very close by is the plant we need. I can take the path or I can take the back way. It may be sexist of me, but I think that anybody who could do this is a monster. Sure, I'm not that way with all the other people. I mean, they died of their own means. Strawberry overdose, too much marinara, dancing too hard, and too fabulously. Oh yes, the owl. Where are you pointed? That away. Let's see what we can find. Well, we're not going up that way. Might be too steep to climb. No, no, we got a good way to climb up here. All right, we good. Al should be pointing this way. But this is the path. Hmm. Well, I'm making an executive decision. I happen to know that the owls point at the, uh, the mental, physical, and endurance stimulus drugs. And since we have them already, I don't really see a need to follow where the owls look anymore. Instead, I'm finding the ingredients for the cure far more interesting. Let's continue heading south. Oops, we already head this way. Let's head a different south. This south. This is not south. I'm so very good at directions. Nothing. Can I not even see the camp from here? Nope.
Getting slightly frustrated. That's dangerous. I think frustration in games like these is... Whoa. I was about to say, frustration is about as dangerous as the creature. Because you don't think straight. Good. God. It's huge. That your stamen, or are you just happy to see me? Titan Plant is right. Let's take this monstrosity back to the. You're kidding me. Fear is another good uh, killer in this game. Fear is the mind killer. It's the little death. Do not drop the plant. What now, critter? Is he swimming? Did he just go out in the pond? I mean the ocean? I think he did. Well, that that was something. And once again, he was scared away by the camp. No, he's nowhere around. I think I got lucky here. Well, let's do a little research. Good God, it won't even fit in the tray area. That's three out of six. All right, all right, I'll take a drink. Jeez, Robert Hughes, keep your pants on. Well, um, there's still plenty of time in the day. I guess we'll head to R1. Before we do, there's a head we need to grab this guy could be useful, and he isn't on our map. Okay. Head pretty far south. Past the uh, invisible stilted... Why would that even be a thing, I wonder? I guess they didn't think about it when they were making that particular part of the map. Okay, I did not think this through as far ahead as I thought I did. Sure. Oh, that was actually quite a gentle steepness there. That's where I want to be, this hill right here. I should be able to see Rigel from here. Nope. How about over here? Yes. That paired with that head right here. And we can now add this to our map.
Cool. Somehow I need to head straight that away. That'll lead us to the path that'll lead us to R1. Let's see, that's directly west. What's up, birdies? There are birdies all around. I feel like Cinderella, who is suffering from the plague. Can't grab those. may have accidentally found another path. So many trails around here. Where Another owl statue. Whoa! Thanks, Al. Very helpful. This must be R1. And it is right next to some sponge like mushrooms. Let's take a torch and put it down again. Pyrokinesis indeed. This isn't R1, but... Hmm. Let's see what's here anyway. A lamp. Nothing, really. Well, we have time, and we've saved. This was clearly some kind of path again. And we haven't seen many remnants of the... Uh, of the civilization that was on this island before. Not this episode. It's all been camps. R1, Rigel, Sirius. Maybe this was, I don't know, the farmland? And these are just young, young trees? I have to say, it's got its own kind of fungus. And a very nice view. I would kill for this. I still maintain that uh, this is probably in a gulf or a sea. The Mediterranean? Don't know. But um, it was pointed out that sometimes the sea can be calm. Don't need you right now. There are no notes here either. Oh, huh? Spoke too soon. What? Well, we have Isabella to thank for that information. And that is clearly the last plant we'll need. Somebody noticed the owls, I noticed. And that pretty much says what I've already mentioned. The owls are always looking towards medicines. It feels like I can do more today. And I still have time in my recording. But there was no... clue as to where...
Where R1? We have this whole area. And somewhere inside it is the last... The last ingredient to the cure. Let's start mapping. I need to find a good foothold. Oh, I should have added that to the map. Any other hidden landmarks up here? Yes. You can hear my mouse going nuts because I'm trying to accidentally add it to my map. Looks like no this time. Mental stimulant, don't need it. Let's head way out here. Just way out here. Okay, maybe too far out here. Hello, giant head. I've seen you. There's also a couple of other things I may have seen. There's plenty to be mapped here. Not sure how possible it is given what we have on hand. And I'm not even sure if mapping is the thing to do. I just figured when in doubt, map. Well, it's starting to get dark. Let's take a trek home. And then we'll call it uh, an episode. Well, not home, but you know, R1. Well, I'm going to go ahead and call the episode good here. And, uh, yeah, thanks for joining me. And stay tranquil, everyone.